Hello friends, welcome back to another video on Android development. In the previous video, we have created a simple alert dialog with two buttons. You can see here. Now in this video, we will see how we can add array list items with checkbox. And when we click on the items and click on the button show, the item will appear in the toast message. So let's create. First remove all old methods that we have created in the previous video. Now call the method builder dot set title. Let's say I type here select items. Now call the method builder dot set multi choice items. Three parameter required. First parameter is the array list. Second parameter is the selected items that is default and the last parameter is the click listener so first we will create the array list so go to the string file here you need to add array list so i have already created array list just copy this okay now go to the main activity again and pass this array list r dot array dot printing system name second parameter is the null because we did not add any default item selected and the last parameter is the click listener so new on multi choice click listener okay here you can add anything so first we will create an array so private let's say i create list that is string type and name it list now initialize it create alert dialog method list equal to new array list okay now when any item is selected then we will store in this list so check the condition if is checked then we will store all items in this list so before this list we will access that items that we have stored in this array list so create the string array and get resource dot get string array r dot array dot operating system name okay if any item is checked then we need to store that item in this list so list dot add here you need to pass that item so by using this array list dot here we need to pass the position which position is clicked so we have added the item and check one more condition if already added and check the condition list dot contain if this list already contain that item then we need to remove so if that part of the list already contain in this array then we need to remove so list dot remove and again pass this item okay now call click listener so builder dot set positive button so first parameter is the string and the second parameter is the click listener okay first put a semicolon here and now here we need to show that message so first we will create string type 
variable let's say I type data and just define it null okay now create for loop actually we are going to show that list in the toast message the reason why I am using this because we did not show array list in the toast message so we will fetch that data from the list and store into a string type variable that is data and then we will show in the toast message so string let's say I type item and it run with complete list okay now data is equal to data plus all items now here we created a simple string so now we can directly show in toast message so create toast message and just simply show this data okay perfect now run the application okay now click on create alert here you can see our operating system are available now let's I check the Android and click on show here you can see Android is showing in the toast message let's say I click more than one items and click on show here you can see Android and iOS if you want to space you can add here space now run the application again okay now again click on create alert and select more than one and click on show here you can see Android, iOS and Windows now again click on create alert and let's say I select Android and iOS and then uncheck this Android now this method will remove this Android you can see now click on show here you can see iOS only iOS appear so if you have any question please ask me in the comment section and please like my video share my video and subscribe my channel so see you next video take care bye